After my trick, um, 1997, I went to PTEC uh, to register for sport admin and management. And then out of that, uh, project and involved in IO. Um, as part of Msebezuamu school. So I decided to buy a tennis strong code to start a tennis club at In 2010, I said, look, let us, not, let us stop Basien Zelenda, but it's a social thing. Masiti Academy. Because Academy is where you produce stars. Let us have stars coming from our locations. So the vision of the academy really started in 2010, uh, whereby we said, look, here we want Mdano Zaupuma up. If I can figure it out national level, but maybe Mdano Zalik the same tennis, that can later in life, na ye abe no kwazo maetom yumdu to start up. So whoever is going to come out of these kids from upper Gle facility is going to be a, a very strong tennis player. A course board apa so mbuye abuye ahlala kokwabo kanye kambe nechomo zakhe ingincede kakhulu tennis because inkhupe izindwele ezinese stratweni because indanga zami izibuye esikolwe ngabe nando kwenza then zenze izindwele ezihlesi then ndani buya ndiye chimini i motto ye to apa ithi participating in sport is winning in life nam ezibande khula i had many many challenges in life and I think participation in the sport helped me to okay, calm it down, but no, relax. So, uh, take decisions. Think before you act. I am six years. I'm not a tennis in the phone, so I'm going to go to school. I'm going to go to school. I'm to get Abandwana up, we couldn't because as you can see, tennis court is in my village location. As no choice, if you see the up, you know, it comes in there. You know, Abandwana every Saturday, we give them nutrition because it's very important for a sport. Ubana, buyers, by don't need dietary right for born, but because of developer, you know, is making that possible. InnoWind is an integrated renewable energy developer and operator of commercial wind energy facilities. In 2012, InnoWind was selected by the Department of Energy to sell power to ESCOM from its three wind farms that are located in the Eastern Cape. Each one of these wind farms is committed to spend 2.1% of their revenues towards local socio-economic and enterprise development. This is done under InnoWind's philanthropic program known as Grassroot Youth Development. I'd like to say, you know, thank you very much.